when you live in a region like ours, the Balkans, and especially if you're in politics in the Balkans, you have only one choice, to be really optimistic, but you also have to be hardworking. So uh, I really believe that uh, the region and Macedonia have the power to change and improve the country, the livelihood, the prospects, especially for the young generation. The key problem for Macedonia in the last 10 years was not really disputes only with neighbors, internal disputes or lack of rule of law. The big critical thing is uh, the loss of people. Uh, the number of young people that have left the country is alarming. So we really need to, to, to improve our country in order to prevent that tendency from, from continuing. I look forward to seeing Macedonia becoming very soon a NATO member state, starting accession talks with the European Union and making sure that uh, the economy creates not only new jobs, but better paid jobs. This is the only way we can actually offer something better to the young people. And by, by doing this, we will also create uh, the, the conditions for having a better quality of life. So some of the young people are not just leaving because they don't have a job. Some of them do great jobs. But you depend also on good education, decent health care, good infrastructure, uh, solving the problem of pollution. So it's the quality of life that we need to move towards European standards, not just the formal political status of the country.